period. I've heard a slogan before where it's not guns that kill people, it's people that kill people. So we need new training and new, new type of ways to look at your community and the people in this city. You know what I mean? That's what it comes down to at the end of the day. And you, you know, you over here, but you guys signed up for this job. How dare you complain about the danger? How dare we out here face danger every day? Without a pistol on our hip, without a knife on You talk about the Mario Wilson, you would have had six people around him with tasers with high voltage at a spontaneous level and he would have died out of a heart attack. So there's no difference. Death is death. Well, there was 59 shots or 50 tasers. You understand what I'm saying? So these tasers are killing people. And if it's, you guys are going to have these things, we're going to fight it to the end. It's been here, like you said, since Fong introduced it, since DA Gascon corrupt self has introduced it, since Surrey tried to reintroduce it. And now you got Scott trying to reintroduce it from LA, one of the corruptest police departments ever. So let's get this straight and understand. It's not, we taser or not, you guys got to change. Something has to happen or else we're going to make a change. And at the end of the day, it's the police commission that's going to do the vote. We got to convince them. We can talk all we want. We got to convince Joe Marshall and all these other people that's selling out our community to understand we don't need these tasers in our goddamn community. We're on the hip